Hey guys, it's Dan back with another review and hopefully it's snowing out there right now and hopefully you don't hear the wind howling because it's a little distracting. You can hear the wind howling in the background. Um, today I'm going to review Electra Volume 1 Bloodlines and this collects issues Electra from 2014's numbers 1 through 5. Written by W. Hayden Blackman and illustrated by Michael Del Mundo. And I have to say, I am super impressed with the artwork that was in this. That was one, I think that was part of the reasons why I really enjoyed this story. Um, for those who are not too familiar, Electra is an assassin. Um, I think I read some earlier stuff with her and Daredevil, but it's been so long. Uh, basically, she has a history. She was killed by Bullseye. She was Daredevil's lover. And, yeah, she was killed by Bullseye, and somehow she was resurrected. I don't really remember how she got resurrected, but maybe I should go back and refresh my memory on that. But anyways, this um, she's got a contract kill out on this guy named Cape Crow, which I've never heard of. And there, she runs into this um, Australian madman named Bloody Lips, which I think he is a super cool villain. Like, he's another assassin-type character that I just found really fascinating. Like, he absorbs, like, certain powers and stuff um, and abilities and memories from eating the flesh or whatever it is that he kills and eats. And it's just super psycho and super weird. And like I said, the artwork. There, There's a number of different cameos by others. Like, um, I can't remember that one guy. He's from the Marauders. And then there's, you know, Miss Bullseye. And Bullseye makes a very brief appearance. So I really, I really enjoyed this. This is one of those Fast and Furious kind of adventure action books. Um, it's not really that much substance, so if you're looking for, like, heavy dialogue, you're not going to get it here. But I, I really, it's the return of, you know, Electra. So, yeah, I mean, it's, it's right up my alley. I like, you know, fast action books every once in a while. And I was, a I was, I actually hesitated in reading this just because I was afraid it was going to be really bad. But I was surprised by how good it was. Um, I did rate this 4 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. I'm not going to share it too far into it because I don't want to spoil the story. Um, looks like it's watercolors or acrylics, like some kind of water media, but it's absolutely done beautifully. Um, I usually, you know, I don't want to, you know, spoil for you, but there were, there were um, a lot of my friends actually enjoyed this too. They thought it was a 4 out of 5 star book too. Um, there were the rare few who gave it two stars, so um, there's a there's a chance you may not like it. I think there were like two out of ten people on my friends list who just didn't like this. I don't know why. Um, I I think one of them thought the narration coming from Electra was was bad, and I'm thinking she might have confused the narrations because at one point the narrations from Bloody Lips and Electra are kind of intermingled in different parts of the stories, so they kind of tell, like, it's like a mirroring telling each, telling different sides to their stories and origins and stuff like that, which I found interesting and was another reason why I really loved this. Um, of course, as always, I will have a link down below if you'd like to check this out for yourself. That works for U.S. residents. It's an Amazon link. Um, I also have a book depository link for everybody else outside the U.S. That They offer free worldwide shipping. They offer the same great discounts as Amazon because they are a subsidy of Amazon. Um, pick up this book or anything else through those links. I get a small percentage of every sale. And I do appreciate those of you who have purchased books through my links because I'm not getting AdSense as of currently. I have all these views, I just lack subscribers. I'm currently at like 521 subscribers, so yeah. People come, they click my videos, they watch them because they want to see reviews, and then, you know, that's it. So yeah, if you want to see more comic book graphic now reviews go ahead and hit that subscribe button while you're there hit that notification bell so you know when i upload again 
that's all I got for you guys. Thanks for watching. Until next time, later.